me now. Hello everyone, this is AppleMaps.com and we're checking out the new puzzle game Kami, which is a color-based puzzle game that is really best explained in action, hence our gameplay video. So let's get in and show you exactly what it entails. So your goal is to create one uniform color across the board. In this particular case, we're working with three different colors. And we're trying to do this in few moves as possible. This level gives us a goal of three moves, which we just pulled up. And that's essentially the base part of the game. There's 36 unique puzzles to play through, each one with ever-increasing difficulty number of colors and fewer moves to work with. So you start out with a little mosaic aspect, as you can see. And if you make a mistake like I did right there, you can press one button to go back. So trying to figure this out the best that I can. Yes, like this. Okay. Figuring it out slowly but surely. And so hopefully you can also appreciate this neat transition animation where the screen folds out the different paper effect as the color changes. Hopefully it comes across on the video as it does come across when you're looking at it straight on your iOS device. This game, it comes from the makers of Lume, which is another papercraft style game. And if you look close, each little square, it looks like it's uh, construction paper. And the developers say this is handcrafted with real paper to apply this Japanese theme. The game is really all about creating a relaxing experience to focus on the puzzle at hand. And then you just get to witness the colors transform. And the style, it's actually been seen in a game called Paint Buckets, which is a flash game. And then it also came to iOS in the form of Color Zen, which was free for a little bit. So hopefully you've experienced that as well. And so this is the first set of levels. And then you transition and you see there's a new color set, and this particular case has four colors to contend with to make it even more challenging. This has a little USC flare with a little black uh, kind of Arizona State pitchfork. Mess that up. Thinking this through. So you kind of have to work your way in reverse order, kind of outwards in, just to think of the very base color of the structure to kind of merge the colors together as you're working your way out. It's a little bit convoluted in explanation, I do understand that. And you got to make sure the pieces are connected when you are changing these colors. And like this. And then let's see a really neat animation. How it spreads outward like that. And so whether it's the graphics or the soundtrack or just the straight level design, it all is about making kind of that Zen style experience. There's really just a beautiful design throughout as the paper's folded outwards to fill colors. And if you can't reach the move plateau, you can still complete a level in advance to the next one and just have it entice you to come back. So yeah, this is going to take five moves. I could probably do it better with more time. That's another level completion. <laughs> relatively simplistic on the surface. Let's try this one again. Actually, this kind of looks like the 49ers. That kind of colors. And as you see, 
see this overall level layout, you can see how the next couple levels have similar ideas, but infusing more colors and limiting the moves. Let's play the last level. This one kind of looks like the Maryland flag for extra complexity, and we have seven moves with which to work. And the one thing missing is a hint system. So you simply kind of have to figure it out yourself or you're not going to figure it out. So I solved the puzzle, but not in enough moves, or in too many moves. But that's essentially what you have to expect if you decide to pick up comic for yourself. It's 99 cents, and it's universal for all iOS devices. And we'll talk to you next time.